what's up guys I'm back again on another video and I guys this time it's on another cologne and this is called revelation revelations man and uh, this is a replica version of Cartier roaster I know you can tell by the baller design right here I don't have the box or nothing like that see that revelation man you see I haven't used too much of it very very little Top comes off. That's what the spray all look like. Okay, and this is made by the, I think it's Diamond Collection, I want to say. Diamond Collection. Alright, the main accords in this is uh, fresh, spicy, aromatic, citrus, woody, and warm spicy. Now with this, what I get, it's more like a, a spicy woody. And basically all what you get is, it's mostly, to me it's mostly woody and spicy. You don't get the well, first initial blast, you get like a, like a sweet citrus. But after about five or ten minutes, uh, it kind of settles down to more of a warm, spicy, fresh, spicy, woody type vibe. Uh, it doesn't really project a lot. It sits kind of close to the skin. Now, this is a, the, the replica version of Cartier Roaster. So, these will be the main accords for that. Once again, fresh, spicy, aromatic, citrus, woody, and warm, spicy. Now, that's for Cartier Roaster. Like I said, this is just a replica version of Cartier Roaster, but it's got to be somewhat similarity, and it's got to be because this is what I'm smelling. All right? And once again, it doesn't get a whole lot of citrus, but just at the very beginning, when you first give that pump, that first blast, and when it hits your skin, and then you smell it like that, you know, you get the citrus vibe. But after about a few minutes... After it settles down to your skin, so you get more of the fresh, spicy, woody, and warm, spicy. And a dominant note to me, man, spices and woods. You know, like I said, it doesn't it doesn't really project that well. So, guy, if you like something to really project, this ain't it. It kind of got a remind me a little bit of Terry Terry D. Hearns. Kind of orangey vibe. I guess it's the citrus vibe that I get at the very beginning. The first initial blast. The citrus vibe that you do get. Kind of smell a little like Terry D. Herms. Then it quickly turns, you know, into more of a woody, spicy vibe. So, uh, like I said, guys, even the first initial blast of this, it doesn't. it's not a real projector. It doesn't project at all too much. Uh, the longevity is better than the projection. I would say, I would say you get anywhere from four to six hours out of this cologne as I wore it before. And, uh, but that's the only thing that really kill it for me. You know, I like something that's going to project. You know, when I wear, like I told you guys, when I wear my cologne, I want to be noticed when I come through. I want everybody to be like, yeah, you know, he's smelling good. You know, because if cologne ain't projecting for me, I'm rocking it. And really, you know, can't nobody really smell it like that. Even I can't hardly smell it like that. I ain't got a whole lot to do for that one. You know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, guys? You know, if I if I can't smell it, I'm wearing it. I'm coming through and somebody else can't smell it. No, I ain't got too much to do for that one. You know, I, I ain't gonna really even mess with that too much no more. God, if I can't smell it, somebody else can't smell it. I know the women can't smell it, so I ain't got too much for it. You know, I ain't gonna reach for that one no more. But yeah, this one, I don't know how the original Cartier Roaster is or whatever. But um, this one here... And I'm pretty sure the original's got to be similar to it anyway, you know. 
in my opinion, I wouldn't I wouldn't purchase this. It's it's just it's just so close to the skin like type scent, you know. You know, it, it ain't nothing that really jump out there and say, oh man, it smells so good. I got to peek that one up. It ain't nothing like that. Now some people can smell a cologne on somebody. Somebody can smell it and ask you say, Oh, what's that smell? You know, where you get that from, you know, uh that smell good like that. And you like, you know, um, yeah, I got him so and so and so and so. That smells so good, you know, I'm gonna get that from my boyfriend or my husband, you know, whatever, you know. Uh man, man, I'm gonna buy that because my girl might like that. Dog, man, where you get that from, you know? I got to have that. It ain't not one of these type of scents, you know. It ain't nothing that nobody really going to jump wild for it because, like I said, it sits so close to the skin. It's like it ain't really got no projection to it, you know. Can't nobody really smell it like that. You can smell it if you... I'm pretty sure you dash your clothes with it, you know, across your co shirt collar or something like right here. You might can smell it, but like I said, man, the projection is so close to the skin, <laughs> you know, it's like, it's so close. I mean, it's just not even worth the hype, man. I don't, you know, it, it's it's like, put it like this, guys, it's like, it's just a, the type of smell that it is, it's just... And it can't, it's like a low dose smell, you know, it's like, it's just one of the type of smells that ain't really going to do nothing, you know, y'all know what I'm talking about, it's like, I put it in this way, it's like a smell that no matter how much you spray, you know, <laughs> I'm going to get a little, it's like, no matter how much of this you spray, it's like it ain't gonna get no stronger. You know, I know you guys seen cologne like that. Like, you can't put this on to make it no stronger than what it is. I'm like, that's the best way to put it right there. No matter what you do, man, it's just it just ain't gonna it don't reach out there or nothing. It just it's just ain't having them kind of sense that that go out. It's just a close it's, it's it smells more like a cologne that when you spray it on first initial blast, it smells more like something you had on already for three four hours. You know, now that's the best way to put it. it smell like it's already been there a while. It's just no projection at all, Harley. All right, that's the best way I put that. One. But anyway, guys, it's been a cologne review of Revelation Man. It's a knockoff replica of Cartier Roaster. If you guys want it, look for it. Maybe y'all got a different opinion about it. Hope you liked this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Definitely don't forget to share my videos. And uh, guys, take care. And um, maybe the ladies might like this. I don't know. I know it just ain't got no projection in it for me. All right. So guys, take care. Share my video. And I'll see y'all on the next video, man. See ya.